Welcome back, young professionals. Intentional living is the practice of making conscious, deliberate choices in alignment with one's values, goals, and purpose. As a young professional, practicing intentional living can help you achieve greater fulfillment and success in both your personal and professional life. You should practice intentional living as it provides clarity and focus to your values, goals, and priorities leading to greater fulfillment, satisfaction, and well-being. It helps in better decision-making, personal and professional development, building a stronger network, and a sense of purpose. It allows you to make conscious choices to direct your efforts and achieve your goals. And with that, here are several steps you can take to practice intentional living as a young professional. Number one, identify your values. The first step in intentional living is to identify what is truly important to you. Take some time to reflect on what you stand for and what you want to prioritize in your life. Your values may include things like family, personal growth, professional development, or community service. Once you've identified your values, you can use them as a guide when making decisions and setting goals. Number two, set clear goals. With your values in mind, set specific, measurable goals that align with what you want to achieve in your life. These goals should be challenging but achievable and they should be broken down into smaller steps so that you can track your progress. When setting your goals, it is important to keep in mind that they should be aligned with your values and not just what you think you should want. Number three, prioritize your time and energy. Once you've set your goals, prioritize your time and energy to focus on what is most important. Be mindful of the activities you engage in and the people you spend time with, making sure that they align with your values and goals. Learn to say no to things that are not important to you and make time for activities that bring you joy and fulfillment. Number four, reflect and review. Regularly reflect on your progress and make adjustments as needed. It's important to continually assess whether your actions are aligned with your values and goals and to make changes as necessary. Reflecting also helps you to take stock of what you've achieved, what worked and what didn't, and what you can do better. Number five, live in the present. In order to live intentionally, it is essential to be present and aware of your thoughts and feelings in the moment. Practice mindfulness and meditation and learn to let go of thoughts and emotions that no longer serve you. Living in the present will help you stay focused on what is important and to be more aware of the impact of your choices. Number six, surround yourself with supportive people. Seek out a supportive community or mentor who can provide guidance and encouragement as you work towards your goals. Surrounding yourself with people who share your values and goals can help you stay motivated and inspired. They can also give you different perspectives and offer valuable advice. Number seven, continuously learning and growing. Continuously learning and growing is an important aspect of intentional living as it allows you to improve yourself and stay aligned with your values and goals. Continuously learning and growing both personally and professionally will help you identify areas of improvement and take action to improve them. Number eight, take action. Lastly, take action toward your goals, set plans, and make an effort towards them. Without action, all the other steps won't lead you anywhere. Be proactive and have a plan in place to achieve your goals. Now, before we get into some of the pitfalls that affect taking action, I want to thank you for coming this far in the video. If you found any value in this video, hit the like button. And if you'd like to learn more tips and tricks to level up your lifestyle, be sure to smash that subscribe button and click the bell to turn on notifications so that you're the first to know when I upload new videos. Now, let's get back to it. Taking action towards one's goals is a crucial step in the intentional living process as it is the only way to make progress and achieve success. However, some people may have trouble taking action for various reasons. Here are a few possible reasons why someone might have trouble taking action and some suggestions for how to overcome these obstacles. Number one, procrastination. One of the main reasons people have trouble taking action is procrastination. This can happen when the task at hand seems overwhelming or uninteresting, or when an individual feels unmotivated or lacks confidence. To overcome procrastination, it can be helpful to break down large tasks into smaller, more manageable steps, set specific deadlines, and reward yourself for completing each step. Number two, fear of failure. Another reason people may have trouble taking action is fear of failure. 
This fear can stem from a lack of confidence in one's abilities or fear of rejection or judgment. To overcome this obstacle, it can help to reframe the way you think about failure and focus on learning and growing rather than perfection. Also, it's important to remind yourself that failure is a natural and necessary part of the learning process. Number three, lack of direction. Some people may have trouble taking action because they don't know what steps to take to achieve their goals. To overcome this obstacle, it can be helpful to create a detailed plan of action, outlining each step you need to take to achieve your goals and assign a deadline to each step. Number four, overwhelmed. People may have trouble taking action because they feel overwhelmed by all the things they have to do. To overcome this obstacle, it can be helpful to prioritize and divide tasks into manageable chunks. Also, practicing self-care and scheduling regular breaks will also help you to feel less overwhelmed and better equipped to handle your tasks. Number five, perfectionism. Another reason people may have trouble taking action is perfectionism. When perfectionism stops people from taking action, it can be helpful to focus on progress rather than perfection and remind yourself that it's okay to make mistakes and learn from them. Ultimately, taking action is a critical component of intentional living and overcoming obstacles to taking action can be difficult but not impossible. It takes time, effort, and a willingness to change. By identifying the reasons why you may have trouble taking action and implementing strategies to overcome those obstacles, you can increase your chances of success and achieve your goals. Remember that change is a process and keep in mind that it's okay not to have it all figured out, but taking small steps is still progress. By following these steps, you can practice intentional living and make conscious choices that align with your values and goals. This, in turn, can lead to a more fulfilling and meaningful life, both personally and professionally. It's important to note that intentional living is a continuous process it requires being mindful, reflective, and being true to yourself. Continuously setting new goals and reassessing previously set goals as you grow and learn. By practicing intentional living, you can gain greater control over your life, achieve your goals, and live a more fulfilling and meaningful life. It's a powerful tool that allows you to make conscious choices and direct your efforts toward what is most important to you. Thank you for watching. If you found this video useful, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out our Instagram at ypl underscore yt. Thank you and see you in the next video.